everyone, so welcome back. It is Wednesday afternoon. Um, I've only been here an hour or so because um, I, I work late on a Wednesday. Um, so just before after school club starts, I'm just going to, I've got a pencil case commission to do and I need to finish that picture that I started last week. I doubt I'll get it finished before after school club, but I'm gonna work towards it because I need to get these Christmas orders done. So that is the plan. I just need to get on with it. So it is only, I think, just gone seven and my Wednesday night girls have gone early because they came a bit earlier. So I'm going home early, so I'm quite happy about that because I get to eat my dinner earlier. Um, so I don't know if I mentioned, but um, I'm in, it's Wednesday. I, I was off on Monday, I had a day off because mum and I do alternate Mondays. And then on a Tuesday, I only work till two or three. Um, we have mum and baby cup in the morning so I didn't really film that but yesterday they made Christmas cards um, so again if you follow me on Instagram I'm at so underscore underscore Jessely um, you would have seen their lovely Christmas cards it's been like horrific weather at the moment so it is a bit quieter at the shop um, I guess people just don't want to drive out here because it's so awful um, and it's especially windy today so so mum and baby was a quiet one, but it was like really relaxed and chilled, so that it was quite nice. And then, um, yeah, it's Wednesday today. I get to go home early. Um, today I'm wearing some really, really old Topshop leggings. Um, I've literally had them for like over more than 10 years. Um, and I'm wearing my So House 7 toaster sweater. Um, this is the one I made for the Minerva. I'm covered in corduroy because I've been cutting corduroy. Um, I'm covered, um, I'm covered. Um, it, this is the toaster sweater that I made for um, the Minerva Crafts Blogger Network. Um, this is my second one they actually made um, for the Blogger Network. Um, the first one was navy blue, and this one's like the traditional one with like the cropped waistband in it. And I added a little monster relief, and there's one on the back of my neck as well. Um, but I love this jumper, so I definitely recommend this pattern. Um, but yes, I'm gonna go home now, and I will see you tomorrow. One thing I forgot to mention is that next Thursday, so Thursday the 6th of December, um, I'm going to be on telly. <laughs> um, I, you may, if you're in the UK, you would have definitely heard of her, but um, if you're further afield, you might not have, but there's a girl, um, a lady, um, called Kirsty Allsup, um, and she has a Christmas show. It's sort of like a yearly thing now. It's like really popular. Um, it's called Kirsty's Handmade Christmas and she does the handmade fair and things like that that she's like the face behind it which is the fair that I've done for the last like five years six years or however long it's been now anyway so I um, am going to be on the show on channel 4 on Thursday the 6th of December at 5 p.m. on Kirsty's Handmade Christmas and I am one of the competitors in the stocking, handmade stocking competition. So I'm like, I haven't been nervous about it at all because the filming went so fast and it was all really quick and amazing. And I just felt like it was like the, one of the, my favorite days ever. Um, even when the day, the day previous that they came to my house and like filmed me in my studio and stuff, like crafting away. Um, I loved every minute, so like I haven't really thought too much about it, but suddenly now that it's like, oh, you can, it, your episode is on Thursday and you can tell people about it, because I've had to keep it secret for 
ages. Um, now it's suddenly all starting to like make me really nervous and um, mum wanted me to do like this like screening thing at my house and we all like come round to mine and watch it together and I was like oh yeah that's a really lovely idea and now I'm like oh no like what have I done um, but we'll see if you're in the UK and you want to watch it then watch it and let me know what you think but um, I don't know I don't know how it's going to turn out I hope I come across as I am in real life Hello everybody and good morning. It is a Thursday. It's definitely Thursday today. Um, what was I going to say? I'm a bit out of it. Mum's really poorly so I've come in early um, and opened up. So I'm here all day which is quite nice because it means that I get quite a lot done. I was going to have a chilled morning but now that I'm here we're going to get some jobs done. So Kay's with me today um, and Luna obviously. Um, I've got teens club later today at 4.30, um, so I have the whole day to get orders done and we've got to do some more decorating this morning, because um, I'm just in that mood, like a bit of a Christmassy mood. Um, if you, I'm wearing my Nora top, my Nora non-stretchy top that I made. Um, I love these Nora tops, I have, I actually have three now, and I've got a fourth on the way. Um, one of them you might have seen on the Tilly and the Buttons blog because it's my example sort of tutorial of my Christmas jumper. Um, so I've made a Nora in Christmas confetti theme um, with some happy fabric vinyls which I'm really happy with. Um, so from I've decided that from the 1st of December on Saturday it's acceptable to wear Christmas jumpers to work. So I only have two handmade Christmas jumpers. Um, actually, no, technically I have three handmade Christmas jumpers because I did revamp a jumper in Christmassy theme. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna start wearing those and then I have some other Christmas jumpers that are on backup, but they aren't handmade. But anyway, I'm gonna start wearing them anyway because you know, it's Christmas time. And then, yeah, so check out the Tilly Buttons blog. I'll put the link in the description below so you can have a look because you've only got 11 days left until the competition closes. Um, so if you were planning on making a Tilly pattern and jazzing it up for Christmas, then you only have 11 days. So by the time I put this video up, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, I'll do a bit of filming Saturday, so it'll be up Sunday. So that's minus, so you only have eight days no about seven days you only have one week until the competition closes so i should have done that a bit earlier i'm sorry um but yeah happy thursday let's get on with the day everyone so basically it's Saturday morning on Thursday which is the last clip you would have seen um my battery ran out on my camera and I didn't have a spare one so I was like oh well like it's in the afternoon anyway I'll just take it home charge it and then bring another one back so I didn't film any of the teen club on Thursday night and then I put my battery on charge at home on Thursday night and I just didn't pick it up yesterday so 
I haven't done any filming for the whole of Friday, which is annoying because I did quite a lot. So I was thinking, oh, Friday's the perfect day. I've got loads to do. I can get loads of filming done. And I didn't do any because I forgot my stupid battery. So that was my fault. But basically, it's Saturday morning. I'm in a lot earlier today um, because we have two workshops back to back. I'm so excited. So the first one is free motion embroidery, which is sort of my favorite thing to do. It's like my speciality. Um, so I've got a full class of eight coming this morning for free motion. And then I've got a quick 45 minutes to like scoff some lunch. And then we're doing a revamp a sweater workshop, um, which I'm really, really excited about. Um, so I'm wearing my revamped schnozzo, well it's not really revamped because I made the jumper, but this is my Nora top, um, my Tilly and the Buttons Nora top, um, with my Christmas confetti design on it, um, which I did for the Tilly and the Buttons blog for a tutorial to sort of give you all ideas for your Christmas jumpers for the competition. So I thought I'd wear it today because one, a lot of the techniques I'm using on here I'm going to sort of show... Um, the ladies this afternoon how to do them and two because it's the first of December so Christmas jumpers are officially allowed in my opinion um, I'm starting Christmas today I'm gonna force my boyfriend to come with me to get the tree tomorrow um, so yeah I'm just very happy and I'm gonna take my camera downstairs and show you um, the finished look of all the lights you can see the lights are up here um, but I thought I'd just do a quick run around before I start prepping for the workshops because it looks really festive <laughs> some of you might go oh my god it's too much um, but we only use 60 meters of lights <laughs> I'll show you now okay so up here we just trailed them I say we Kay did the upstairs ones because I had loads of work to do so she's put them all along there so there's a bit of twinkle up there and then they go all the way down the stairs. Da, 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 da. And then they continue across the top of the wood there. Um, so all the way down the stairs. And then we did them all the way around the mural. And then all the way over there, around the top of the garland. And then we did like a scalloping, scalloping? Scalloped it like style across the fabrics so I just love it absolutely love it So I have really messed this vlog up because it's Monday. It's Monday because on Saturday, after Mum and I cleaned up after all the workshops, it was like past five o'clock and we just headed out. And then I realised that I left my camera behind so I couldn't even edit it. So what I thought was I'll film today, Monday, and then I'll edit it tonight and hopefully get it up tonight for you. Fingers crossed. So. I can't breath again. <laughs> it's because I ran so fast up the stairs. Um, in about 10, 15 minutes, Knit and Natter starts. So I might do a little bit of filming of Knit and Natter. I'm wearing my Christmas jumper again just because it's so cosy and I like it. <laughs> um, I am very tired. I'm, I am feeling a bit run down at the moment, but I had a really nice weekend. Well, I had a nice Saturday anyway because I was like busy and working and I had two really, really fun workshops. So I was happy with that. Um, and Sunday, well yesterday, well we saw friends Saturday night and um, 
went to see some Christmas lights and then Sunday my brother and sister came to see me and then I saw my best friend before they go on holiday and then um, Hugh and I got our tree so that was really fun um, so yeah I had a nice Sunday anyway um, I did have a bath and go to bed quite early but um, I'm still tired I don't know Granny oh we did have dinner with Granny last night as well um, Granny did say that she thinks I'm lacking vitamin B so I might have to go and buy some and just take them because I am sudden I don't know why I'm just feeling really really run down at the moment anyway it's fine because I'm happy and I'm doing what I love and it's nice to be busy because if I wasn't busy at Christmas then I'd be very very scared but yes I'm waffling it's Monday time for knitting natter <laughs> So it is 10 to 5, so I'm just going to get out the crafts for Mum and Baby Cub tomorrow morning um, and organise them ready for me to take downstairs in the morning. Um, tomorrow the mums are doing fabric painted stockings, so I'm really looking forward to that because I think a lot of them have been excited about that one for a while. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to tidy up, put the Mum and Baby Cub stuff out and then I'll shut up the shop. And then I've got to take Luna for a walk in the rain. The dark and the rain. Great. Okay, so that's me done for the day. It's five o'clock now, so I'm just going to go downstairs and shut up. Well, I'm, I'm also going to shut up the shop. <laughs> um, but yeah, I've had quite a good day, actually. I've got quite a lot done. Um, and it was nice knitting natter this morning. I didn't really feel much of knitting natter apart from right at the end because I forgot. But I'm hoping that I'll edit this video tonight and get it up on the same day. Um, but I can't guarantee that. So I'm sorry if it isn't uploaded tonight, which is Monday. But yes, thank you very much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Make sure you comment below with any questions or any feedback or anything you think I might like to see. And I will see you hopefully at the end of this week with another vlog. And I might also film Thursday night when me and my friends and family watch me on telly because I think that would be quite funny. Um, I am still freaking out about it, but we'll be fine, it'll be fine. So yes, I will see you at the end of the week for hopefully another video. Happy handmade, everyone. Mm -hmm.